I help you, gentlemen? I would like to speak to Mr. Monroe. <laughs> We're just gonna cut you off. I'm afraid it's impossible. Mr. Monroe's schedule is between... Didn't you just say that we could come up for him? Go to the chase, sister. You could have just told us that on the phone if... I'm not at liberty to reveal that, officer. Yeah, you so are. hired you for your intelligence? <laughs> I find that offensive. You have every right to. This is getting us <laughs> You can see now. Would you like us to Whoa. return with a warrant? That won't be necessary, gentlemen. Come into my office. All right, Leland Monroe. You weren't one of the guys in the room that screwed me over, were you? You like a cigar? Drink, boy. Sure, I'll have a scotch. Biggs. <laughs> We're investigating a series of domestic fires, Mr. Monroe. Terrible yeah. Boy. I think you're behind it. I'm going to kill I you. Help? I think you're behind it, bitch. And I'm going to kill you for it. But right now, I'm just going to take up my gun and shoot you. Game over. Oh, yeah. Can we speed this up a little? Oh my god, really? You people are so impatient. God, you're not, you're not, you know, if you want to have a good reputation with the police, you you best do well with me, okay, buddy? Because I'm the pinnacle of police investigators here. So, promotional, travel, local land acquisition, okay. Elysian Fields and Suburban Redevelopment Fund flyers keep turning up in the vicinity of the fires. Ooh. They're turning up all over town, boys. Are they? Can you imagine the current demand for housing? So that's your explanation, Mr. Monroe? Coincidence? Explanation? <laughs> I don't know that I word. To explain. I advertise on radio and billboards for buyers, and I advertise for sellers using waybills. What are waybills? Oh man, this guy's kind of tough. No, he has that like smirky, smarmy douche face. He's obviously not telling the truth, but... We hear that Suburban is under severe time pressure to complete... We did hear that. Houses. I think you're getting heavy-handed about it, and it's gone wrong. I yeah. I you have some proof of how I'm involved in this. I'll be happy to sue you for whatever you're worth. Damn, you fucking jumped to conclusions fast, buddy. Jesus, I didn't say anything. I didn't even suggest anything. I was just asking questions. God. It's a prank, bro. Relax. Let's see. Destroyed in residential fire. Um. Hmm. There's nothing really to say that that implicates him that that way. Like I was with evidence, I mean. Um. Doubt. We found a family burnt out in their home. Another house burned to the ground. Another Elysian Fields flyer. Our information is that they didn't want to sell. Yeah, that's a pattern. That Seems that to be popping to up. Me. Is that your point? Point is. Could be. Every time we find a family barbecue, we find one of your flyers. Is that good advertising? That's Rancho because Escondido, big. Cause that's not Elysian Fields. <sighs> what do you know read. about a competition for families to win free vacations to Catalina Island? My company runs many promotions. I don't know about that one in particular. I'm not familiar with that one. Oh, wow. <laughs> Who called it? Who called that bullshit lie? Level with me, Mr. Monroe. You know all about the vacation offers. You can believe whatever you like, son. You're missing the vital ingredient called proof. Uh... That's... That's a good point. I guess I am. How do you not know about this, though? It, well, okay, you're not literally in the picture of the Catalina Island thing, but you're you're in the flyer with it. You think you would know something about it. You would know that it exists. It's your fucking Don't ask, you never company for crying out loud. I mean, seriously... Mm-hmm. I mean, are you really so stupid that you're gonna fucking try to pull that shit on me? Does that... Fuck it, I'm doing intuition. Remove an answer. Bravo! This is why I don't like to do remove an answer, but I don't like to do the other one because that just makes it too easy. Because then... Because the other one... 
the other one basically makes it obvious. Uh, ah, oh shit. Whatever it was, the, the one... Ask the audience, because it basically tells you, like, what the majority opinion is. And that's usually, if not always, correct. So... Uh... Because most people, I guess, would eventually play it back and get it right, even if it was tough the first time around. I don't know. It's probably good, like, early on in the game, but at this point, I don't know. I, I just try not to do it, because it's just... I don't want to make it too easy for myself. Let's see. Doubt. Lie. Um. So... I'm not familiar with that one. <sighs> okay, I'm um I'm taking a chance. Your face is all over the flyers, Mr. Monroe. Okay, cool. You know about the prizes, and you're aware that they get given to holdouts. My face holdouts. is the brand. It's on all our advertising. Yeah, so you should know about it, bitch. Did you know that the mayor and the chief of police? Oh. Fund? Oh yeah, you're gonna try that intimidation tactic on me now. Well? No, I'm accusing you of murder for now. I mean, I mean, if you want to bring them into light about it as well, I'm perfectly happy about to do that, you know? Or bring all those fuckers down. They fuck me over. I'll kill them all! I'll kill them all! Office to buy houses in areas where fires have been recorded. <laughs> yeah, we kind of said that already. Are you suggesting that I'm burning people out of their homes so that I can sell them new ones? What yeah, that's kind of been the angle this whole time. Refuses to sell. We work around them. Business finds a way. Yeah, by burning down their houses. <laughs> it's way too vague. Less than candid, Mr. Monroe. <laughs> to put it lightly. These homes to some timetable. You're under pressure to get rid of the holdouts. And how exactly do you think you can prove that in a court of law, detective? Well, that's for the court of law to decide, uh, Mr. Monroe. We're not in a court of law right now, so. We'll worry about that later, buddy. God. B b bring, him, bring him in, Biggs. We, 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 we arrest people for less than this, so just bring him in. <laughs> Honestly. Uh, I don't know why we don't. I don't know why we don't. We're police. We have, like, all the authority in the world. Oh, okay, I guess he is ahead of us, but... In some way. I guess he has a financial foothold on our cocks, but other than that, uh, what am I trying to get evidence for again? Oh, yeah, we got nothing, nothing there. Personal. I'm just doing my job. You understand that? Uh, what do you? S oh, whoops. What do you say again? Uh, we work around them. Business finds a way. Yeah, it's way too bullshitty for me. Come on, Mr. Monroe. You expect me to believe that you would build a new development with one of those old piles smack bang in the center of it? Progress is an inexorable <laughs> process, detective. Mm -hmm. Those who choose to stand in defiance are usually confined to the waste basket of history. Like you? To answer your question. Bitch. Yes, we would build around them if we had to. Most people see sense. Yes. Do they? Do you have any suspects? We aren't at liberty to say. I didn't. <laughs> of course you didn't. Contracting You're in bed with the chief of police. You suppose there could be any of that? I have a list of their names if it'd be of any help. That would be very helpful, Mr. Monroe. Be careful, you might be trying to manipulate us. I'm always happy to help the LAPD. I'm sure you are. My secretary will provide you with that list. Did you know that I'm on the board of the police pension fund? Yeah. Yeah, we did, so what? Nice to be of help, officer. That's not gonna work, you know? That's not gonna fucking work. It may work on him, it's not gonna work on me. <laughs> I'm way too young for that shit. What's the story? I don't even Any care if I die. <laughs> uh, wow, Herbert Chapman. Herbert Chapman is on this list. I still don't remember who that Find is. Find the phone. We need to know where we're at with Chapman. I don't remember Chapman, honestly. Wait, does she not have a phone? 
Really? You don't have a phone? Yeah, there's a phone. Give me that phone. Let me use that phone. Really, you bitch? You're not gonna let me use that phone? Well, you know what? You're ugly and your hair sucks. Get out of here. Alright. How about your phone? Your boss is a fine man. <laughs> cool. <laughs> She's like, oh, okay, cool. I'm going back to work. <laughs> Alright, excuse me. I'm just going to use your phone quickly. Thank you. Yep. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. Phelps, one, two, four, seven. Oh my god, there's that guy again. Fuck off. Can you check whether we are still holding a Herbert Chapman? Let me find out for you. Is he the crazy guy? I don't know. I don't remember. He was released this morning, Detective. Oh. Well, I didn't really have him on anything. I'm sorry, Detective. All he did was run, if Thank I'm thinking of the right guy. Can you give me a last known address and put out an APB on the guy? I'll get back to you, Detective. APB will go out over KGPL shortly. Thanks for your help. Cool. And you, we need to have a serious discussion here, all right? You gotta knock this shit off. Okay. Okay, because... Okay, because if, if we have an issue, I would like to sell it now. I, I don't want this to be going to endgame, where you suddenly reveal you've been spying on me the whole time, and then I'm gonna have to shoot you and stuff. Because I would rather not have to do that, okay? You know? Maybe even you'll shoot me. That's what I'm trying to avoid here. I don't want to die. What do you not want to be? Hey, I'm taller than you. <laughs> That's funny. You're short. Look at you. I remember you being taller. What are you liquored up? Uh, no, but you were the first time I met you, bitch. I'm trying to pose off as a hobo, and then now you get like multiple jobs in the course of like days. How the fuck does that happen? <laughs> are you just really bad? Like. Are you just really bad at the job and good with interviews, or do you just quit for no reason? Quit to follow me and stalk me and know exactly where I'm going to be at all times. This is too conspiratorial to not be true. Mm. Wait a minute. Holy shit, are you... Are you... Oh, you're that bartender. Hey, hey buddy. Hey, dude. I'm the guy that I'm the guy that interviewed you back in Homicide or whatever. You're, you're the bartender. You're one of the bartenders. You had that temp who turned out to be the killer. I bet you were behind that too, weren't you? Huh? You're probably behind that. I bet. Yeah, you were. I'm on to you. Oh, then I got this. I got this partner. You gotta take care of some old finished business. Or I gotta finish some old business. I gotta take care of some old business. I gotta tie in. I gotta tie some loose ends. To have some loose ends. Right now. Uh, I think I'll do a lot more than that, buddy. I don't think those are my real intentions here. Not really self-preservation, more like self-interest. Come on, this game is stupid. He should have been run over. It's just so bullcrap. Um... If there's one thing I can do, I'm gonna try this first, okay? Hold on. I have an idea. I do have one idea. Okay, watch this. Can we hit the siren, Phelps? Wait, wait, stop running, stop running. Wait, stop, 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 stop. Ah. No, stop running, you idiot. God damn it. Okay, wait. Wait, wait, it's okay. Wait, no, 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 it's okay. Why would you do that? Okay, okay, watch this, watch this, watch this. Shh, okay. And, hiya! No! God damn it, really? Okay. I'm gonna. No, you fuck off. Don't flip me off like that. Idiot. Okay, hold on. I gotta take care of this. Nope. I'll spend all playthrough doing this if I have to. I'll spend all session doing this one. Did you read about the. That's right. You stop talking. You shut up, buddy. Whoa. Okay, partner. Quickly, get in. No! Damn it! You fucking cunt. 
Come on, I hit him. This game sucks. Why do I get to hit my partner, but I can't hit this fucking douchebag? Are you blind? Ah. Uh. No, you do not have fucking. You do not have fucking gymnastic dodging reflexes. Screw off. Oh come on. Okay, partner, just get in. I'm getting sick and tired of this shit. Get in, partner. Let's go to the next place. Oh my god. It's gotta be so fucking difficult. Good thing they see you coming. Fuck you, asshole. Fuck you. Nope. Fuck you. Fuck you. You're fucking dead now. Fuck you. Oh shit, he really is dead. Ah. Uh. <laughs> um. Remember when Nicky and his boys were shooting up the whole town last week? I heard that cop there is the only one that called back. Yeah. It's another day's work here. Okay. Uh. Anyway. Oh, I can't. I can't get in now. Alright, cool. Well, this wasn't my car anyway. Actually, it was. Oh, well. <laughs> uh, so, partner, I guess you're trapped in there for whatever inexplicable reason that defies all laws of physics, but. Uh. Uh, yeah. So. Um, well, I tied up loose ends. I, 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 I did say I was going to tie up some loose ends, and I did it, so I stuck by my word. And that's all that counts. Alright, so I just committed a murder, but we're just going to ignore that. It's all good. Uh, let's see. I don't think that's going to go on the record. Maybe I'll have to pay some fines, but I think I'm okay. Oh no, the police department will pay the fines. I'll be fine. If anything, I hope I, if anything, I, hope I get promoted after this. I'm killing two birds with one stone. Oh yeah. Oh shit. So what happens if I try to, like... I'm curious. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. Yeah. Drive. Drive, invisible partner. Alright, cool. Alright, let's chill out here for a bit. Yeah. This is cool. Alright. Uh, get back in. Oh, okay, it's right over there. Never mind. Not much more to go for. Yeah, well, you're black, so I don't think you have any room to talk. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Rancho Escondido, 1.24 p.m. Pacific you know, Standard Time. There are times when you really miss hey, partner, where'd you come from? There's more religion in the end of a night stick than in a hundred cathedrals. Oh, really? You're saying being a policeman is a religion, partner? Maybe it is in a way. Again, sir. The law is kind of our Bible. And we follow it just about as well. Oh, shit. You sorry Whoa. Well, what, what happened here? What's going on? Why is everyone fighting? Whoa. So pacifying here. What's pass... What's, what's pacifying about this? This looks like more like just fighting. Oh, hey. Wow. Oh, really? Nice nice job, genius. Oh, can you hit me? Huh? Oh, 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 nice one. Oh, oh, too late. Oh, oh, just a little too far. Just a little too, just not, just not far enough. Oh, oh, nice try. Oh, 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 too bad. Oh, wow. Really bad. Get out of here. Oh, shit. Fucking idiot. Think you can fight me? You're out of my league, son. 
Oh, you want to go up for more? All right. Huh. I didn't even need to dodge that. <laughs> you stupid idiot. Get owned. Can't beat me. You showed up when you did, detectives. Those folks were baying for blood. Yeah, and he kicked your ass. You're a fucking police officer. Jesus, pathetic. Take a look. All right. Sure thing, partner. Let's look at this mailbox first. All right, it's crooked. That probably means it was turned over at some point, either before, during, or after the explosion. Partner, is there something there? Nope. Oh. Yes, there is. Ooh. Interesting. Interesting that. Mortar is like dust. Is that normal in a fire? You'd expect some shrinkage in the heat. But it looks like the cement barely adhered to the brick. Doesn't appear to be any wall ties either. This thing looks like it was built on the cheap. Huh. Oh shit. <laughs> nice infrastructure. You got an idea, hot shot? Uh no, this stumps me. Alright, case closed. I don't know what to do. I love the shade Wait. Canada winds, a beautiful okay. face to rose love to me in it. Give me your heart. Oh hey. Without his hat. None of us have our hats now. Do you, do you still did you still lose your hat from like from that time, buddy? Really? Buy me a drink, Cole? No. <laughs> Not even for old time's sake. Not even for that. You fucked me over. You're not gonna buddy. ask me why I'm here. I wouldn't give you the pleasure. I'll get around it. So I was expecting him, wasn't I? She's in fine voice this evening. I wonder how the commander would feel Save about the threats for someone who cares about them. You're breaking my heart, Cole. <laughs> you know how I feel about you. You don't really care, you just wanna... You just have your own self-interest to look forward to. Stay away from Elysian Fields. Wow. You should've known that you were playing Aaron. You're blunt. You and your doofus partner. You have been warned. Thanks for your cooperation, officer. You know, I could just take a gun and shoot you right now. If I... If this was like Stay a... Stay away. If this was a choice game. I have game. no idea the type of people that are involved in that company. I have a pretty good idea, Roy. The same kind of people that sent you here. Your investigation is finished. Homicide will be taking over from here. I've heard we've had a spate of grass fires in the hills that you and that hunchback might be able to handle. Thanks for the drink, Cole. Elsa's apartment, 8.45 in the morning. Eight forty-five a.m. Yeah, Earl delivered it. You? The Kelvin started making noises about my pension. <laughs> Sorry about that. A lot of corruptions. A lot of corruption. Save it, Phelps. Monroe was an asswipe, and so was Earl, and so was McKelty when it's all said and done. I already forgot who that is. Is that is that our is that our arson leader? Captain, whatever. 11K, go ahead. Ooh. Throwback to homicide days. Roger that, KGPL. 11K en route. Let's go pick him up. All right. You fought at Sugarloaf, didn't you? I did. But I don't like to talk about it. You come across a guy called Jack Kelso out that way? You know Jack Kelso? He's an insurance investigator over at California Fire and Life. Our paths cross from time to time. For some hmm. reason, seeing you makes me think of him. Has uh, Jack spoken to you about his experiences on Sugarloaf or the rest of the campaign? Jack keeps stung just like you do. I know what it feels like to get back from conflict. You gotta respect that. Respected. Respected a lot. Oh shit. We gotta respect the feeling? Or we gotta respect that they feel that way? I mean, it's probably understandable. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, God. Uh, 
Let's see. Oh, man. Cloudy days again. I love it. I love this feel. This mood. I don't even remember this for Arson, honestly. I thought it was all sunshines and rainbows. <laughs> no, not all of it. Arson does certainly... Well... It does certainly get to the bottom of some things. Oh shit. As we we'll uncover. Claim to depart. Well, we fucking already do that anyway. They basically pay for all of our, all the shit I've done. Hopefully they're gonna pay for that murder too. <laughs> oh god, I haven't forgotten about that. At least we took care of his accomplice. Cause I'm pretty sure that was his accomplice in all this. He just got away if it's got free. Now he's dead. To be honest, I wasn't even killing him for that reason. I just felt like it. <laughs> and plus he was being an asshole to me, so... You know. It all works out. Alright, good. So, how much further? We're right here. Cool. Oh, of course it's all the way around. Alright. There we go. Chapman's apartment, 9.18 in the a.m. Pacific Standard Time. We're looking for Herbert Chapman. I'm looking for him, too. I'm oh. here to move his car so I can mow the lawn. He's definitely not here. I've been banging on his door off and on for a couple of hours. Yeah, he's out somewhere. Is there some kind Let's of problem? Let's take a look at the car. All right. Check the trunk first. Always check the trunk first. Let's see what he's hauling around. For some reason, everyone always leaves all their suspicious stuff in the trunk. <laughs> like, no one will ever check here. Definitely gives him opportunity. We forget about motive, detective. We should revive the APB. He's clearly armed. Is he? Well, he left his ammo here, basically. I guess there's some bullets missing. Could have been shot, but I guess we never know. Oh, hey, look, mosquito coils. And hard evidence. Do we have motive? Oh yeah, he likes fires. Or wait, I don't. I still don't know who. I don't remember. I still don't remember who the fuck he is. Honestly, so. Hold it, Cole. There he is. It's Chapman. He's coming out of the laundromat. Oh, okay, so it is the crazy Shit. guy. He's seen us. Really? Cops. Oh, Again. okay. Yeah, it's him. All right, cool. Son of a bitch! He must have caught the trolley. We gotta move fast, Cole. Do you take it over? I'll call this in. Get some cars dispatched. Car 11K calling KGPL. Yeah, BP probably took it over. 11K oh, he's holding requesting him a assistance. In pursuit of suspect aboard the 1110 University Street. <laughs> currently heading east on Melrose Avenue. Okay, I don't think there's anything I can do about units. this. Suspect is in control of car and Seriously, like, how can my car possibly fuck this up? Oh, God. If anything is going to screw me up. In real life, I probably would have been stopped. I probably would have been stuck there. Stay on his ass, Cole. Don't there. lose him. Oh, wait, it's raining. Yay. Really? Oh, look, fireman. Go, go, go. Get him. Spray hoses. Spray, spray a hose on his shit. And spray water and electricity and then See electric. See if he can damage one of the wheels. Might act <laughs> and like everyone in there. Slow the thing down. It's not probably not how it would work anyway. Hold him tight, Cole. Wait. As soon as he ditches the tram, we'll be there to grab him. Alright, so basically we just gotta stay afloat. Oh my god. Get me closer to the driver's cabin. I'll plug chat. Oh really? You gonna shoot him? I don't know if we wanna shoot him though. Yeah, we'll try. God damn it. the line, you little prick. Come on, Cole. How'd he stop? Why'd he stop? He screwed up the whole thing? I guess it fell off the line. What the fuck? 
he just came out and I had no gun on, and then he just suddenly took out his gun and shot me. What the fuck? I couldn't... And then I just had to whack him with it. What the fuck? What the fuck? That was bullshit.